Nepal has some of the highest mountains on Earth, so developing nationwide communications has to be challenging. So challenging that few thought digital connections would be possible. Dr. Mahabir Pun, winner of the prestigious Ramon Magsaysay Award for Leadership in Asia, decided things might be different. I worked as a teacher for 12 years in Nepal, and then I went to America to get my further education. Then I came back to Nepal in 1992 and I decided to stay. In 1996, Nepal got internet, first time. But I had to walk one day down from the village to the nearest town and check my email once in a month. And uh, that is uh, one reason, you know, I was trying to find ways to bring internet in the rural areas. The second thing is, uh, we had to send some messages from one village to another village. Uh, we had to walk three hours, four hours, sometimes one day. And I was tired of walking from one village to another village, like doing that for several years. So I was, you know, trying to find ways to bring internet or develop a communication system between the villages. Computers were very expensive that time. There was no way we could afford to buy computers. So when I went to America, I brought used computer parts, actually from the recycle center, and uh, built those computers in wooden boxes. The very first antenna that we built on a tree to connect uh, my village to the nearest town to get the internet connection. Telecommunication engineers, I talked to them, they said, no, it is not going to work. Why do you spend your time? Don't waste your time. That's what they're saying, you know. And I said, oh, no, no, why not? Oh, no, let's try. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. That's fine. And so we kept trying and then became able to build the first wireless network in 2002. 30, 35% of the country has access to electricity. The rest of the country does not have electricity. And this is usually the urban areas across the country that have computer access. And that's, that's the reason why, um, even though there is an optional course in computers for schools, according to the government curriculum, most schools do not have computer as a subject in schools in the villages and the rural areas. The state in Nepal says that Nepal has the highest hydroelectric potential, but then to generate electricity out of that hydropower needs a lot of capital investment. To build the wireless network, we of course need a power. But when we build the relay station in higher places, those places we don't have power from the grid line. We have to use solar power. And when it is cloudy and then we have, sometimes we have problem uh, because there is not enough power. So we expanded the network to these nearby towns. Our goal that time was just to, you know, use the wireless network for communication, at least between the villages, and to communicate with outside world using the internet. But when we kept working on the network, then we found that, I mean, wireless network can be used for doing video conferencing. 